Namaste to all. I'm Dr. Ramya, Associate Professor and Head Department of Panchakarma at Ashtanga Ayurveda Vidya Bedam. I'm extremely happy today to share some of my viewpoints on the topic Panchakarma as a preventive therapy. Now, what are Panchakarma? Probably Panchakarma is the word that is seen and heard mostly with respect to the term Ayurveda. Ayurveda equals to Panchakarma and Panchakarma equals to Ayurveda. And Panchakarma is something that has been understood and misunderstood widely among the public. Now Panchakarma has got a great role in both preventive as well as curative role. Now what is Panchakarma? Panchakarma are the penta biopurificatory therapies that are mentioned in the Ayurveda Shastra which help the physician to combat the disease both in the preventive aspect as well as in the curative aspect. They are Vamana therapeutic emesis, Virechana therapeutic purgation, Vasti the enema that is again of two types the Kashaya Vasti that is formed by decoction and Sneha Vasti that is formed from Taila or uh, any of the oil, Rakta Mokshana, the bloodletting therapy and Nasya, the nasal administration. Now what is the role of Panchakarma as prevention? See, the society of today is basically combating for many diseases. Ultimately, we have become a society which are more of drug dependent rather than health dependent. To prevent these occurrence of diseases, I feel karmas or the panchakarma has got a great role, especially in the arena of lifestyle disorders. Today we could see that many of us are basically dependent on various kinds of drugs, whether it is for diabetes or hypertension or hypocholesteremia or for thyroid etc. Here plays the important role of karmas because all these metabolic disorders basically indicates that the body functions has been deranged. The body is now responding in a negative way. So what we are supposed to do is basically to correct the body metabolism and the body can correct itself. Panchakarma helps in that. What basically Panchakarma does to the body is to stimulate the body to correct itself. Depending upon the doshic status of the individual after analyzing him in an Ayurvedic perspective, we decide which is the best possible karma to the particular patient. Now how is that going to work? Every disease basically has got its own response to the body that basically deranges these functional elements called doshas of the body. Which dosha has been deranged in the body to the maximum is basically understood and the karma respective to that particular dosha is done. Even to a healthy individual, panchakarma can be done as a preventive perspective. For example, if an individual, his parents already have got diabetes, they always have an option to naturally get diabetes in future. So when they are 30, 35 plus, when they have a little high blood sugar and all, what are we supposed to do is try to prevent it by correcting the metabolism. So understanding and analyzing the individual's body, we can make him undergo these procedures. How can a person be undergoing these procedures? It's not, it can't be just done like that. Only after analyzing thoroughly, every panchakarma is basically divided into purva karma, pradhana karma and paschat karma. The preparatory procedure, the major procedure and the after procedure. And once that is happening, that is correctly done, definitely the body responds itself so that it can be corrected and further diet and lifestyle changes can support the individual. So hence I feel the role of Panchakarma especially in the area of metabolic disorders like diabetes, hypertension, hypothyroidism which is eating our society as a monaster. I think uh, uh, 
Panchakarma has got its greatest role in the preventive aspect. Thank you.